Hello friends and welcome back to my channel. I have another course breakdown for you guys today. This one is on ethics and professional practice in information technology fields, um, so in computer science. So most programs I'd say, um, as far as I know, have some sort of ethics course or some sort of like professional practice course, just to give you an idea of like issues that have come about because of what industry you're in or like issues within the industry and how your industry that you may be working in affects the rest of the world, how it affects the environment, all of those kinds of things. I think that generally it's important to have a course like that um, just because you can, you know, you can learn as much as you want about like anything really. You can learn as much as you want about computer science or math or biology or psychology or film, whatever you want, but at the end of the day, at least this is how I see it, at the end of the day, what you're doing is going to affect the world in one way or another. And I think that it's like socially, it's a social responsibility for you to be aware of those ways and for you to kind of understand and grasp how your career affects the world and how you can affect it in the best way possible, if that makes sense. So that's all what this course was about. So we basically, um, it was an introduction to ethics, computer reliability and safety, um, privacy, computer crime, intellectual property, impact of computers on work and society. So basically just all of the ways in which technology has kind of affected our lives, um, like how it has affected our security, how it has changed, you know, like, black market industries and crime and that kind of thing. We covered a lot of controversial topics that have come up over the past couple decades um, with regards to like what technology has really allowed us to do lately. So I found this to be a pretty exciting course because since information technology and like the internet and really having a career in computers is such a new thing, all of the issues that we dealt with are reasonably new and controversial issues that are still going on today. Like it's not things that have happened in the past because like this is happening right now. So I thought that was really cool. Our assignments were in the form of blog posts. So we actually um, set up a WordPress blog and we um, had a few posts per week. We didn't have to do all of them, but you have to do a certain amount of them in order to like get fulfill that mark. Um, I loved that because I just got to write about, I mean like the kinds of things that you talk about in an ethics course as well, you're almost 100% going to have an opinion about them because they affect everyone including you. I love that vlogging world. So when the professor was like, you guys get to make vlog posts, I was pumped. But yeah, so that was how our assignments were. The one thing about this course, so like, I thought that it was a nice change from all the technical courses and all like the code heavy courses we had um, because we it was just a more social like discussion course um, a lot of people in my program I think maybe didn't like that as much I'm I know that I'm playing on a stereotype right now but I mean all I'm saying is that my friends from other programs tend to be a lot more outgoing and loud and presentation people than the people that I am in computer science with. So that was one thing that I think made a lot of people uncomfortable. We were definitely forced to get up and talk in front of the class and discuss with each other when normally it's a very silent classroom in my computer science courses. Um, but that was kind of fun. I thought it was a really nice change up. And I mean, I freaking talked to myself on the internet. So obviously I'm not overly upset about that kind of thing. So that was the kind of stuff that we covered in ethics and professional practice not a difficult course unless you're not really good at social science type courses um, I personally like those courses and as I said I loved that it was a bit of a change up so I did pretty well in that one thank you guys so much for watching if you have any questions please leave them down below and I will get to them as soon as possible but thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to smile and I'll see you all in my next video bye